Hi it's Charlotte, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video I am going to be talking about 10 brown outfits. I don't know about everyone else but I've literally been living in the colour brown. I don't know what's happened but it's just seemed to like just taken over the world and taken over Instagram and honestly I'm just obsessed with it. I've just been buying so many brown items and it turns out I had enough to basically make about 10 outfits and I've been seeing like a few people do reels where they do like 10 nude outfits, 10 like brown outfits so I kind of wanted to make a reel of it in the process I thought I'd make this into a video as well um, but if you'd like some inspiration for some brown outfit ideas then please carry on watching um, I do I sometimes in my last few videos I literally I just forget to move to one side of my screen and then we just have issues when editing basically yeah I'm basically just going to talk through all these outfits most of these items I've bought recently so I should be able to link them down below for you but if I can't I will try and find something similar okay so this first outfit is an outfit I've already actually worn in the last few months it is this brown Zara bodysuit um I bought this a few months ago and then the faux leather brown trousers are also Zara actually so um this is literally a whole Zara outfit by accident and then I've got this little cute brown like 90s style bag which is from ASOS oh my god I've been loving this bag so much I paired this bag with every single outfit by the way so just so you know <laughs> yeah I've already worn this outfit a few times and I absolutely love it I don't mind mixing my brown tones I mean you might but I actually really really like this outfit and these faux leather trousers are so so comfortable I'm absolutely loving it and these square necklines I'm a little bit obsessed with so that is outfit number one. Outfit number two is very very simple it's this dark brown skater rib dress. I got this from Primark I want to say last year or perhaps the year before um so obviously that they might not do this anymore but I just think any sort of like dark brown knit dress is just super super cute i've been loving my knit dresses at the moment so if i can find another brand that maybe does something similar at the moment but i just think this dress is really really cute and it's obviously a really simple way of doing a whole brown outfit by just finding like a dress or a one piece because then you're already there for this third outfit i've got this really chunky dark brown new look jumper i actually bought it on asos but it is new look and i bought this quite recently as well and it's so soft and comfy I thought it was going to be itchy when I first bought it but actually it's like so so comfortable and I've worn it so so many times um, and then I also have this call it houndstooth yeah this sort of like brown and cream houndstooth mini skirt from Topshop um, again I think I bought this last year so possibly they don't do this anymore with a couple of these items they are not completely brown so this is a good example this skirt is like brown and cream but I still counted it as like a brown outfit um i don't have tons of solid brown items so for some of them it's just browns in the pattern or something but i honestly this skirt is so so cute there's quite a few skirts in this um video oh my god this fourth outfit if this isn't like 2020 trends in an outfit i've got this white shirt on which is from zara and yes it is very creased i didn't have time to iron it for this video um Paired with this like brown plaid knit vest that is actually from Shein so I'm sure that they still do that and if not a lot of brands do these sort of designs like everyone's doing them and then I've got this mini skirt which is in this like brown leather this is from Primark which I bought I think about two years ago so again we can't go Primark at the moment and it makes me very sad I need to do a Primark haul ASAP as soon as they're open although I also don't want to be in crowds <laughs> but yeah oh this outfit is just so cute like i thought i was about to go into head into the office or something to be fair <laughs> this fifth outfit <gasps> oh my god i i'm not gonna lie i kind of was making fun of myself with this outfit like i don't think i would go out in this outfit just to be clear like this is an instagram outfit don't get me wrong i love both the pieces the the bralette the brown bralette which is from zara and the brown flared leggings are from topshop um, both are quite recent, I've bought them in the last few months but yeah, I don't think I'd wear them together I mean, I just don't think I would and then the sunglasses, oh my god I mean, I do really like the sunglasses, they're from Shein um, and I just sort of had to put them with at least one outfit because I just found it so funny I actually probably would wear them on like a summer holiday but I wouldn't just wear them for the sake of it 
you know like the way that some people can just look cool in them yeah I, I don't think I could do that but um here we go I'm sure it will appeal to some people and I don't think I looked semi cool but I just wouldn't wear it out <laughs> oh my god it's next outfit oh, I thought it was so so cute I feel like from first glance it's like that's not a brown outfit but I mean it technically is um, I'm wearing like a dark brown ribbed top which I believe is from Primark, I think so. I feel like you'd probably be able to get this from anywhere, but this one's from Primark. I then have a brown and like, it's like brown, black and cream uh, plaid mini skirt, which is from Zara. Even though from far away, it kind of looks a bit green. I don't know why it does. Um, it must just be more of like olivey brown tones maybe. And then I've got this hands tooth blazer from H&M, which again, from first look, it doesn't look brown but it is a houndstooth that's got like black, cream and brown in it. So I let it pass. And at first I was like, oh, this plaid skirt and a houndstooth blazer, like that's not gonna go together. But then when I look back at the pictures, the color tones are definitely a little bit off, but I kind of think it looks a bit cute. Or is that just me? I'm also wearing, by the way, white chunky trainers with all these outfits. I kind of decided I don't really have any brown shoes, firstly, and the white chunky trainers did go with like half of the outfits um so i was like i'll just wear them with every outfit but um there are some outfits it does not go with so you're just gonna have to ignore that and i'm really sorry <laughs> this next outfit oh my god i love this outfit so so much i mean ugh, i should stop saying that because i mean why else would i put the outfit together um i'm wearing this brown fluffy and white striped jumper which is from asos um that is quite old so i'm unlikely to find that um, and then some tan leggings from Zara. We were starting to like run out of brown ideas at this point. And then this, oh my God, this brown leather jacket. I think this is so, so cute. This is from ASOS, um, very new in ASOS. So I'll probably still be able to link this exact one. Um, and I absolutely love it. I think it's so, so cute and such a good find. Um, it basically makes the whole outfit. So I really, really like that. Next outfit. Oh my god i love how well these two pieces go together i was kind of struggling at first because i was like right i have this brown leather faux leather blazer and that one's from zara yeah it's from zara and i was like oh, i don't know what to put it with i don't know what to put it with and then i remember that i'd bought this um like rust brown dress from zara oh my god it's another whole zara outfit <laughs> i think i saw someone's post the other day it was like another another day another zara outfit that is literally me <laughs> but literally how well do these go together I literally put the outfit on and I was like, ooh, this is going to be my next going out outfit. <laughs> like, next date night, next drinks, I'm going out in this because I just loved it so, so much. It's obviously more of like a tan brown outfit more than like chocolate brown, but um, I do still really like this outfit. I think it's very, very cute. Next up, this definitely isn't my favourite outfit. In fact, I think it's my least favourite outfit only because not because i don't like the outfit because it's not really brown in fact i kind of let myself down because i did so well with all the other outfits i feel like um but you know I, apparently i didn't have 10 outfits in my wardrobe apparently i just had like eight or nine um because when i got to this point it kind of got a little bit hard so i've got a tan roll neck which is from asos um some like tan tie leather shorts which are from zara and then i've got this like faux fur gilet which is from Shein, and I kind of think the gilet is kind of what I was aiming to be like the main piece because I would say that that is sort of like like beigey brown tones, but just the, the outfit underneath is like tan, so that kind of let it down. Um, I do really like the gilet. I think that would be a really nice added touch to like a brown outfit. Not my favourite outfit, but we put it in there anyway, apparently. <laughs> and last but not least, oh, this outfit is so cute. And I can't get over it. Um, it's this like chocolate brown cohort from Puma. I don't think I can say anymore. It's this high neck crop top with this like really tight elasticated skirt. Like, I'm sorry. It was just so flattering. Um, so I really love that. And I thought that was a really good finish to the 10 outfits. Um, and then I also made it into a little reel, which I mean, if you follow me on Instagram, I'll put it here. Then I'll probably be posting the reel around the time that I um upload this video but yeah that was the fun i had with trying to create 10 brown outfits <laughs> so yeah that is the 10 brown outfits that i tried or attempted to put together please let me know if you enjoyed it down below and if if you'd like me to do another video like this with like black outfits or cream or white outfits then 
I would really like the challenge to do that, although with white and nude, I feel like it might be quite easy with my wardrobe. <laughs> but yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you're new to my channel. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!